His Excellency, Dr. Mohamed Irfan Ali, has stated that Guyana's participation in the upcoming United Nations 26th Conference of Parties, or COP26, will be re-establishing the country as a leading example as a net carbon sink economy. The head of state said this during his virtual press conference on Friday. Guyana will be participating fully, both at the policy and political level and at the technical level. The focus for COP26 will be on four themes, including enhanced country commitments on forest and land use, including reducing deforestation and accelerating forest restoration, scaling finance and investment, including private sector finance, sharing action towards sustainable production and consumption, and four, support for local people and, uh, and, and stakeholders. We intend to signal our commitment as every other nation that we'll have a responsibility, we all have a responsibility to climate change, but it must be differentiated. At COP26, President Ali highlighted that he will be championing the recently launched draft Low Carbon Development Strategy LCDS 2030, which promotes the sale and preservation of carbon from Guyana's pristine forests while still aligning the country's oil and gas industry with the decarbonization of the globe. Meanwhile, he stated that Guyana must sign on to renewable energy targets that are achievable and realistic. These targets and ambition will be in keeping with our energy strategy and programming. We must appreciate that Guyana is already a net carbon sink. We'll address issues of accessibility to financing for mitigation and adaptation for small island development states. We'll pursue initiative, initiatives to strengthen and expand the market for the sale of carbon credits. And we intend to renew our call for the implementation of of the commitment made to the fulfillment of the $100 billion pledge. During the Hallmark Climate Event, which launches this Sunday and runs until November 12 in Glasgow, Scotland, in the United Kingdom, President Ali will engage in bilateral discussions to promote Guyana to investors and major financial institutions.